Hi everyone, Patchman21 back with another insufferable unboxing and we have Infinity Crates. Full size. Okay, um, the price will be on the side and any other incurred charges, shipping, uh, bank charges, that sort of thing. And we're aiming to get down to a plus figure to indicate that we've got good value. And value is in the eye of the beholder, so I'm aware of that. So it's just cost injury. Um, okay, and another patchy fact at the end of this one. Look forward to it. Right, should we crack on? Oh, if I've got a code for this, I don't know if I have. I'm not 100% sure. But if I have, it will be also in the description. So feel free to use it to get your first box. Bloody tea, yes, for me. Okay, so. T-shirt first. And what they usually do is wrap everything around it. There's a bunch of crap falling out of it. T-shirt. I'm quite pleased I didn't get this in my size. Although I would imagine somebody would really like this uh, Mario with a sword doing a bit of uh, a sword and a shield. So he's been doing a bit of a link action there, I would assume. But it is a Mario shirt. It's gilding, heavy cotton, good quality. Uh, it looks okay, to be honest. Not the sort of shirt I would wear, but it looks okay. Now, at the corner of my eye, I've seen something that has massively pissed me off. <sighs> Another goddamn stupid Pokemon hat. This would have been, if I hadn't thrown away, given away one of them, my third. Now, I get click crates, and click crates deal with a lot of duplication from loot crates. This was originally in loot crate. Now, it's in infinity crate. No, just bad show. Bad show. God damn it. Uh, a matrix puzzle. Which, again, I'm fairly confident I've had before. Just seeing if it's got any relevance. I've definitely had a Matrix puzzle, because I remember I had it and I gave it to somebody who likes puzzles, or has the time for puzzles. So, a Matrix puzzle, believe me, I'm not going to build this and show you a picture of it. Um, it's not going to get done. Uh, we have a figure, which is Dobby. Dobby with a sock. Is sad because up until a few days ago I didn't have Dobby and then my lovely girlfriend went out and as a special treat just bought me a random pop and it happened to be Dobby and I was very pleased about it and now I have two not their fault I suppose but yeah sucks okay there is a sticker it might actually be I mean it could be Fallout but I don't know, there's something not quite right about it. If you know what the reference is, by all means tell me. Actually, I might make a good thumbnail, hold on a sec. There we go. That's the thumbnail. <laughs> oh, awesome. Anyway, a sticker. <laughs> this thing, Spin Attack, Fatal Blow, Link. What is it? Is it a card? Yeah, it's like a blown up game card of some description it's a bent out of shape hmm hat just no no do they not look at other people's unboxings or content or anything like that and say hey let's not be the same as everybody else let's have unique shit in here now they just go and buy everything that's already been done oh, god damn it infinity crates I can't really complain. There's fairly substantial items. The only throwaway are these two bits of crap. 
I mean, it has got a pop. I do like things, and this is definitely a thing. And I've already liked this because my lovely girlfriend bought it for me. So, oh, I am so torn with this one. I'm going to have to have your opinion on this. If you'd like to uh, tell me what you think of the box, what you think of the items, do they get value for money? I mean, again, with this one, it isn't going to be about the fact that that's got into the plus or well, if it is, if it's in the minuses, it is going to be about that. But I have a, a nasty feeling that this is going to do quite well for the money. But of all of this, this is probably the only thing I like. Um, the T-shirt, again, it's, it's a bit of a throwaway. So... I can say the cost is going to be there, the, the actual value is going to be there, but it's, oh, I don't know. I've seen people with these, they love them. I don't know if they're stupid, and I don't certainly want three of them. Um, bleh, yeah, sorry. Anyway, that was that was that unboxing. As I say, just leave leave some comments, tell me what you thought of this. Um, it's pretty short because there's hardly anything in it. So uh, if you've made it this far, we're not going to have the magic word. The magic word would be... There's no magic word. Anyway, patchy fact of the day. Fact. If you reheat pre-cooked chicken, it produces a toxin that is lethal to chipmunks. I've been Patchman21. Thanks for watching. Bye.